Well, hello everyone, I'm here with another LEGO Brick Addicts review, and first one in quite a long time, because, you know, of the controversy and everything. So, and this one is on what was just released, is Kylo Ren and Sith Trooper, based upon Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. Yeah. So, in front of the box here, you see LEGO logo, Brick Addicts logo, and picture of the two that come within and the names and the numbers and Star Wars logo and age recommendation 10 and up seven set number 75232 has 240 pieces see the in film picture of both of them then looking different directions and how you put them on the bases and the booklet came with two which are smaller in size compared to most other ones, and interesting that Kylo Ren's doesn't have a QR code like you'd like see on most sets on the back. Just the two again, and Sith Troopers on its back is I went on the online survey and all the pieces included in, in the set. So first of all is the Sith Trooper. They're very interesting to look. Well, I'll get the base off of which. Well, as a lot of uh, red with accents of black all over. And the legs of which built similarly to most of the other uh, stormtroopers and whatnot. And blaster also the same, and back part of which also like that. A couple of ports now, but as for the face built of which is quite the same, almost like Captain Phasma's ones. So, and to get some, they like printed tile and slope there, and also above. Also, this other tile here as a belt detail. But not much else to say, but even though it's almost as disappointing as uh, Captain Phasma once has. So, and I guess that's about it with Sith Trooper. And now to Kylo Ren, of which a little more cool than that. So, as for the lower area, it has those like. Like Revo pieces there acting as the as the belt or the bottom of his cloak and also a tile for the belt and and the lightsaber it seems it's been for the minifig version since twenty fifteen. But as some good snot on the back acting as his uh, back part of his cloak, you know. And also for the like front area with this tile and this slope acting as parts of his helmet with the red lines in it, which the minifig version also did. Red lines make to mean that he may put the mask back together again after what he did in Last Jedi. And also do you get these the curved slopes around acting as a hood and all. So this is which making him quite a good bit better than the 2018 version of, or unmasked Kylo Ren. And with each base, don't get any prints on them like the other ones, but whatever. And what else is there to say? Yeah, not much, but yeah. So now on to the final verdict. So overall, this is which a kind of good Brickheads 2-pack. Like, finally get a new update version of Kylo Ren, which we haven't seen since 2015, but also with the mask and everything. With Sith Trooper, which not very many people are calling out for, but although would have been cooler if it was a small version of Dio, or maybe that would be a little too much, or let it be of uh, Janna instead. If you're watching this Lego, make sure to have some more briquettes in the future. Let one of them be Janna and uh, Dio for Ride of Skywalker. And of course, of the Mandalorian and whatnot. 
and while if you're looking to get, start your collection of brickheads again, well, this is kind of a good way to start off. If you can find it at your nearby Target store, well, go ahead and pick it up. And that's about it with this video, and thanks for watching.